let's have a beautiful experience in this video we're going to talk about how going with the flow can help your penis grow it's a beautiful thing you gotta love it all right before we get started here please do me a huge huge favor please ring the bell subscribe to the channel and of course follow me on my social media i go by Jesus underscore Detroit on my Instagram, Snapchat, I'm Young Dago. And that's right, we're going to talk about how going with the flow can help your penis grow and help, you know, everything grow. Because that's what we're all about here in the BCC, the Big Cat Consciousness, the Big Cat Collective, where you can manifest a bigger, wider, thicker, longer, stronger, and higher penis. Naturally raised testosterone, human growth hormone, and I'm a spiritual guide and a mentor, and I could definitely help you out, so... Any serious inquiries, hit me up in the DMs. It's a beautiful thing. Now, without further ado, I'm here to tell you about going with the flow and how it can help you grow. Now, what this all correlates with is you can get lost in everybody's do this or do that to make you manifest the best. And I'm just here to tell you that there is no wrong way about going with anything that you want to do. There is only your way. So you got to find the way that works for you. Now, I always like to talk about how people all get lost in the, like, fad diets or, you know, becoming, uh, you know, a vegetarian, pescatarian, whatever label and stamp and wrap you got to put on it to make you feel something. That's all on you. But what you got to do is really look with them. And people spend thousands of dollars on, you know, getting their bodies tested to figure out what works with them and what doesn't work with them. And they do things called epigenetics. And I've heard about this through the London Reel and that Brian guy talks about it. And, you know, the thing with me is when I hear all these, these the, you know, the test results of you know, if you, you can find out what works with you with, a, you know, your diet, I think it's a beautiful thing if you want to go that route, if you're really into that science type of thing. But with me, I kind of, you know, I tend to feel like there's more magic in this place than just what, you know, schematics and paperwork can be there to tell you. You know, I'm more about, you know, coming from within. And I understand that the light inside of me is inside of, you know, it's running this beautiful avatar, making me manifest the best. And all this stuff that's around us is essentially, you know, somebody else's test. So when you're going with these results of we're going to do these epigenetics or not, you're going to be, you know, finding yourself what works for you. And you can go, like I said, you can spend all that money and, you know, they could tell you, um, to me, a skewed results because your mentality can essentially affect the test. And that might be like, yeah, that's, there's no way you can prove to disprove that. But there's been people out there with, um, you know, uh, personality, dis personality disorders where they feel like they're, you know, multiple people. And one person could feel like he's got a disease, and then the other person could feel like, you know, everything's beautiful, everything's cool. And you check them out, and... The, the results would show that, yep, this guy's got it, and then the, and the other results would show that he doesn't have it. So I feel that your mind is the magic of everything. So write that down. Your mind is the magic of everything because we are divine. We are more than what, is every, than what everybody is telling us, man. You don't need some paperwork to tell you, how, you know, where you're at. So with that type of mentality you just go with the flow of your own of your own go and you know like i do my uh for my diet technique i do the one two three and it's just you know the first thing you do is you eat it you see how you feel and number two we check the deuce and you gotta see how it's coming out you know if you know if you really feel inclined to become a vegan and then you find out that plant-based protein isn't working with you and it's making mud down there What's going to, you know, where, where are we going with this? Are you going to be, uh, you know, are you going to go try to be a vegan when your body obviously is telling you something else? You got to come from here, man. And that's why I always, you know, come with, you know, you always got to come with love. Whatever you're doing, 
as long as you come with energy, you come with love, you can do no wrong. So write that down. If I love is energy, and with that there is no wrong. And when we come with that type of energy, with that energy, that attitude, you of course got to start it with gratitude because every single day when I'm going along my way, before my feet even touch the ground, every breath that I get to take, I am just happy to be blessed that I get, you know, that I, I'm here, man. I get to take a shot today. It's a beautiful thing, man. So if you're breathing, you're achieving, be happy that you got a breath because you got a shot. You're beautiful. I believe in who you are. I believe in your cock. If you want it to grow, that's what we're all about here. Because, you know, the triple D. And you know I ain't talking about Jenner's Davids and Drives, Guy Fieri. We're talking about don't doubt your dick. I'm here to make you believe in what you have. Understand that we are divine. Understand that we're not here to put anybody down. We're not here to put your guy down. We're here to bring him up, make him huge, make him, you know, make that huge piece of meat, swing at the knees and thrive to the pecs. Making you your best and having you know understand that you know we're more than you know we're more than we even know. And when it's not about you know making fun of your piece, you know, and like I said, some people if you're smiling, you're doing something right, because a smile is divine, it's made inside the mind. Write that down. I love the sound. And if you're making somebody laugh today, then you're definitely doing something right. But if you're making your guy down there, if you're making your, you know, if you're making your stick, your stick then you know that's just that's your own bit that's your own business but to me i feel that it's unnecessary but if you're making people laugh and it makes you feel beautiful that's a beautiful thing so you know but like i'm saying you know build them up feel good about who you are and like essentially go with the flow of what we are man like you know, i do the I, pr I do a towel practice called the Wu Wei flow and it's just pretty much just going with the path of least resistance something that i do on a daily definitely helps me feel beautiful it's just you know something that i like you know other towel practices that i do i include the no fab semen retention i follow montag chi he's uh you know towers from china he definitely believes in you know why you want to hold in your seat and how it naturally raises your testosterone and how it you know charges up your chi because chi is energy and you know some people might think that this is crazy like why would i you know want to you know hey why would i want to go to the point of you know of no return and then uh, not go that much further you know what i mean but to me the ride and the journey is more than the prize and you know when you get to the end there it's like what are we talking about you know the release to me has to be worth the ride and if you're just doing it for just that part of the journey i mean i feel like what is you know what's the point you know i mean you just want to show up there and be done i mean it's like i want to be able to have that thing just you know grow as big as it can go keep it thriving keep it growing help my muscles grow have all that energy come back into me because that's essentially what we're doing when i do you know masturbation for manifestation which is a technique that's taught in the bcc super edging which is one of my claim to fame and like it's just like you know all these all these penis exercises have been around but you put your own twist and spin on them and you find what works for you going with the flow to help you grow so when we're talking about super edging you know i've talked about this before but more or less you get that piece you know throbbing as hard as you can man and you just make it just throb and grow and you just keep pulling on the top of it making it even bigger and we don't stop, you know, and by the time you, you're about to erupt, you back off. And instead of making that go out, you take that energy and you send it within. Montag Chi preaches that you can actually use the healing orgasm to heal body parts. If you feel ill in any area, you can send that orgas orgasm up through your lungs, to your kidneys, to whatever part that you got to put it. To me, I just put it where the muscles are. I feel that the energy should be there. Just put it back into me. Keep my skin glowing, hair flowing, body growing, and spirit knowing that, you know, this is something that's divine because I feel that sex is beyond the body. And you know me, I always feel it, you know, when I'm, if I'm sleeping at night, if I'm in the astral realms because, you know, everything is on the chakra system. You got the third eye right here. You got the crown up there. And we got that heart, man. You got to always come with love, man. One of the most supercharged centers of the whole chakra system. Your penis is on the root. 
and that's something that you shouldn't overlook man and that's something that is felt beyond the body so when you're sleeping at night and dreaming you know you could be in the astral realms out of your body and have an, an astral realm boner you know what i mean <clears throat> and uh yeah it's real i mean that tells me that sex is more of a divine feeling and you know all truths are true so whichever ones you got to find to make you you go with that and you know i'm not here to say any anybody's more right than anybody but these are things that i've noticed and i feel and what what comes to me and when i'm in those you know astral realms i feel that the body you know whether i'm in it whether i'm you know fantasizing and you know living my best life or whatever if i'm a huge massive giant stopping a concrete with my huge piece of meat throbbing up to the pecs and i'm able to suck it or if i'm you know flying around or whatever man because you know me when i go to sleep at night i'm dripping that dmt joe rogan and i ain't got to snort for it jab a vein for it i ain't got to smoke for it all i gotta do is sleep and I am battling it out in the master realms, and I'm seeing that there's more to this place than what is felt here in this dimension, and I know that there's more than what we are feeling. So that's why I always got to go with the flow to definitely help you grow, and you get to see that there's more than one way to go about this. And there's no wrong way, man. So if you're whatever you're doing, if it's helping you become the best you, then you stay doing it. And if I feel that, you know, you know, like one of my greatest quotes that I got to say is, we might all be on the same planet, but we're all from different worlds. And as long as your world has love in it, you're doing no wrong, man. We can all just exist in the, in the expansion of the universe and just float or whatever, you know, planets like to do or worlds like to do and shape and shift and do whatever we got to do to exist. And as long as we're coming with this, we are doing the right thing. And you know me, I always got to share this matrix hack that definitely just makes a place a better experience. And wherever you go, wherever you're at, you always want to come with the flow. And you just got to have the intentions in you to just make people just intend on them to feel beautiful, have a beautiful day, and be on your way. You ain't even got to smile at them if it doesn't feel right, man. Because if you want to flex a smile, you got to go... 100 with it you got to own a smile you can't just kind of do it you just be neutral intend on the best in here and just keep going otherwise you know because like i always say man if you want beauty to appear you got to keep this clear write that down one of my favorite quotes of the day if you want beauty to appear to appear you got to keep your mind clear which is why you got to definitely incorporate you know meditation into your uh, practice if you aren't able to get away from your thoughts and that's that's the beautiful thing about it definitely helps you out definitely will help you understand that more thoughts are things and you know you can kind of look at it from a neutral perspective like are these me are these somebody else and you get to scrap what works and doesn't work and it lets you understand that there's more to this place and just your thoughts because you get lost in the monkey mind as they say or whatever you want to call it and that's why i go with that Wu Wei flow and it definitely helps me grow and you know how this can co all correlate in the penis growth and muscle growth and all that is you got to be clear for growth because you are a conduit of just energy and just love and when you have it clear and you're running at your best you're going to manifest the best and of course you're going to have to put action in the practice with your you know exercise and whatnot but then again you can always find your flow of the day of what works for you because not you know i understand that not everybody is created the same in one in one way or another some people might have you know it's genetics and this and that and it's just like look you know People have, you know, certain blessings that they're born with. Like some people might have big calves, some people might have a big ass, some people might have shredded abs. And, you know, and, and you can tell on this with people that just don't have to try to have them. And you can just double down on what you have. Or you can just, you know, really work on what you feel needs to be brought up. And if it's something like, if you're somebody that's blessed with calves, obviously, you're not going to have to train them every day. But if you're somebody that, that uh, you know, is blessed with, you know, something else like, you know, a big booty and you want to make it even bigger, 
you have the ability to do that. But like in the great words of C.T. Fletcher, all genetics eyes are head start, motherfucker. And that's, you know, that's some real things, man. You know, head start, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, you still got to put in the work to find it and make it your way. So whether or not, you know, whatever it is, you know, you're going to be able to grow. You just got to believe in what you are. And that's why I feel that daily exercise, you know, definitely putting your intention and your mind into your penis or whatever part that you want to bring up will definitely help you manifest the best because it keeps your mind on, you know, keeps your eye on the prize, it keeps your mind on the size and will help you, you know, become your best version. Like you might get lost in all these other people's ways of, okay, you don't have to train your calves every day, you don't have to train your abs every day, and you're looking at somebody that's already got what you're looking for, but it's like, you got to look at yourself, and that's why going with the flow is all about helping you grow, because you got to scrap out, like, you got to be like, all right, what's working for this guy isn't this guy, I got to come inside this and see what works with this, you know, if th this guy's a vegan, he thrives, this guy says being a vegan, we're all up. Uh, you know, we're all, uh, if you look at the genetics, we're all, uh, we should be all herbivores. And it's like, you know what, you can get your science and this and that. And on your planet and in your world, that makes sense. But to each their own, man, there's no wrong way about it. It feels right to you. I'm not going to say that it's wrong. But if it doesn't feel right to you to do that, then you shouldn't have to be forced to go along a way that isn't the way for you, man. There's, there's a, this is a beautiful thing, man. That's the thing about life. We all have our own identities and we have our own, you know, practices and rituals that make us unique. And that's a beautiful thing, man. And finding your way along the way is really what it's all about. That's going with the flow. That's going to help you grow. That's going to help you manifest the best. And not worried about getting lost in the rest and understanding that, you know what, in the great words of Rocky, why could change? You could change. Everybody could change. And I, I just feel inclined to say that, man. And You know, if I got a smile on your face, I did something right. If not, you know what? Put a smile out there anyways. And whenever you go out there, man, intend on everybody to have a beautiful day. Intend on everybody to grow. Be that ray of sunshine. Be that ray of light. Understand that we are divine. We are magic. We are beautiful. And I'm here for you. And, you know, with that, I feel like I'm going to, you know, close up this uh, beautiful experience yet again because we're going to have plenty more to come. I want to intend on you guys to spread love out there. Always come with, always come from the heart with everything that you do, man. As long as you're coming with this, you are doing no wrong. Always smile. Always spread that love. Intend on making yourself grow. Intent on making your penis bigger, wider, thicker, longer, stronger, and harder. If you need any extra help, man, you get in, you get in my DMs. I'm here for you. I can teach you some, you know, more one-on-one -on -one techniques. I'm a spiritual guide. I can help you increase your size, and I can help, you know, expand your mind. So, with that, there's going to be plenty more beautiful experiences to come. And, of course, you got to, you know... Ring the bell if you haven't already. If not for me, do it for Rocky, because I didn't hear no bell. Ring the bell! So, you know, with that, man, you guys are beautiful. I love you guys. There's plenty more to come. I'll see you around. Peace.